What is going on everybody? So today your girl Boosty has got another video for you guys and today I'm going to show you a banded booty workout. I love training glutes with a booty band because I find it brings the glute activation from like here, real low, to like all the way out here outside of the frame of the camera. Using bands has really helped with improving my ability to, you know, do that mind and muscle connection with my glutes. The bands have been so crucial for me for the past year because I've had to do a lot of at-home workouts. Um, and they provide a lot of resistance for me to grow that thing, that thing, you know, the booty. So, and of course, I am going to be using some fabric booty bands. So the ones I'm using are the ones from the Luna collection. These bands come in a light, medium, and heavy resistance, which is perfect for all levels of fitness. And even though I feel like I'm an advanced lifter, intermediate to advanced, I still have to use the light resistance booty band because it's so great for different kinds of exercises. You don't always have to use heavy resistance if you're advanced or intermediate. So super, super versatile. And they come in a pack of three as well. And if you have not already, definitely check out the new line of clothing that was released on Luna by Lucy. We have so many, so many different types of tops and also bottoms. This top is one of the sports bras that was released. It's the Focus Sports Bra in Frozen. So yeah, I will have my website link down below and you can see all the clothing and also the fitness equipment that we have available. And also if you don't already, definitely follow me on Instagram. It's just at Lulu. And whenever I'm not on my YouTube channel, you can find me on my Instagram, posting stories, photos, videos, your name and your girl Lucy be posting it. So definitely follow me on over at my Instagram, subscribe if you're not already and hit that notification bell so that you can be notified every time I upload a new video like this one. And I did want to mention this is going to be a follow along workout. I'm going to try to do more of these since a lot of people have been asking them, asking for them. So enough rambling. I hope you guys have an amazing day and let's get started with this workout. Alright ladies and gentlemen, so today I got a banded booty workout for you guys. It's going to be made up of four circuits, five exercises with no rest in between exercises and a 30 second rest at the end of each circuit. So this is a follow along booty workout because yo girl Lucy has got you all. I listened to you guys and you guys requested more follow along workouts. So I'm going to give it to y'all. So the very first exercise is banded quadruped side kicks. So we about to get started in three, a two, a one and get on your knees and go. So for this exercise, I am using a light resistance booty band. The one I'm using is from the Luna by Lucy Collections. So we're gonna place the booty band around our thighs and then we're gonna get onto all fours with our knees and our palms on the ground. We're going to straighten out one leg to the back and then we're gonna move this leg to the side of our body. And then we're gonna swing this leg back to where it was, which was behind our body and repeat. So for this exercise, we are primarily going to be targeting that gluteus medius muscle. And we're also going to get activation in the gluteus minimus muscle. After 15 reps with each leg, your side booty is gonna be screaming in pain. Being like, girl, why you gotta do this to me? So we are gonna switch legs and do the same on the other one. I was waiting on the day you would come back to me Hoping that I didn't burn a bridge I couldn't see and Now that you're by my side again I'll never leave you behind Life was days and sleepless nights so tired of it. I can't get you off my mind, can't forget So the second exercise in this banded booty circuit is a banded sliding hip abduction combo. So I'm using a light resistance booty band and a pair of sliders.
So for this exercise, we're gonna place the booty band around our thighs just above our knees. We're then going to place both feet on a pair of sliders, so your heels should be on them. We're then gonna lean back and the angle between our hamstrings and knees should be 90 degrees. And we're going to abduct one leg out to the side, bring it back to the middle and do the same with the other. And then we're going to abduct both legs out and that's considered one repetition. So for this exercise, we are primarily going to be targeting that gluteus medius muscle and we're also gonna get activation in our gluteus minimus muscle. So I love this exercise because since we're in a pandemic, a lot of us aren't able to go to the gym and this is such a great alternative to using the hip abduction machine or what I like to call it the birth giver machine. So now we're going to move on to the next exercise. So the third exercise in this banded booty circuit is banded quadruped kickback pulses. So get on your knees and your palms and we about to get started. So for this exercise, we're gonna place the booty band around our thighs just above our knees, and then we're gonna get onto all fours, and then we're gonna kick back one leg towards the ceiling, and then we're gonna pulse that leg up and down. So for this exercise, we are primarily going to be targeting the inferior portion of the gluteus maximus. So we're gonna be targeting the lower booty. And now we're gonna switch legs and do the same with the other one. I love this exercise because it's so easy to feel your booty activating and also firing up. It's such a great exercise to either start with, put it in the middle of your workout or at the end as a killer booty burner. The fourth exercise is good old bandit squats. So these are slow squats though. And get into position, ladies and gentlemen, because we're about to get started. So for this exercise, we're gonna place the booty band around our thighs, just above our knees. We're going to place our feet about shoulder width apart. We're gonna make sure to keep a straight back and we're gonna be leaned forward. And then we're going to push your hips back into a squat. Make sure to push your knees outwards against the resistance of the band so that the band doesn't prevent your knees from caving in. And we're going to descend slowly and then we're gonna pause for a bit at the bottom. So for this exercise, we are primarily going to be targeting the inferior to mid portion of the gluteus maximus and we're also going to get secondary activation in our gluteus medius muscle and gluteus minimus muscle because we're adding in that band and we have to consciously push our knees outwards and engage in a bit of a hip abduction stance. <laughs> And the final exercise in the booty circuit is a banded side squat and side kick combo. So for this exercise, we're gonna place a booty band around our thighs just above our knees. We're going to step out to the side into a squat and then we're gonna come back up into the upright position. From here, we're going to kick our leg out to the side and our leg is gonna be slightly bent. And then we're going to go back into the side squat and repeat. So for this exercise, we're primarily going to get activation in the gluteus medius muscle and also the gluteus minimus muscle with the side kick. And then we're going to get activation in the inferior to mid portion of the gluteus maximus with the side squat. I love these sort of combination movements that consist of two different types of exercises because it's able to target different areas of your glutes instead of just like one area specifically, like this one's targeting the side booty and also our lower booty. So now we're going to switch legs, get into position and do the same with the other leg. Waiting on the day you would come back to me Hoping that I didn't burn a bridge 
So we just finished the first circuit, hooray, and now we're gonna rest for 30 seconds. So I have a little timer here to let you know when the 30 second rest is up and when you gotta move on to the second circuit. So you can go to this timestamp here and it will restart the entire circuit and you can do that for the second, the third, and the fourth circuit. So let's just get on with the video. So before I end the video, I wanted to let you guys know that the Women's Best Smart Bars are now live on their website. These are one of the best tasting protein bars I've ever tasted. They don't taste proteiny at all, and I normally don't like peanut butter, but this tastes freaking bomb. Like it tastes like a Twix bar almost. So it comes in three flavors. We got salty peanut butter, hazelnut nougat, which is my second favorite. This one also is really, really good. Probably almost tied for first place and then almond coconut cake. I'm not a huge fan of this one. It's still good, like I still have had a lot of them, um, but definitely recommend the salty peanut butter and the hazelnut nougat. All three bars have 20 grams of protein. And yeah, I've been eating these a lot. As you can see, I've already finished quite a bit of the salty peanut butter ones. Um, each box comes with 12 and I've been trying to um, save these, like not have them so much because they're just so, so good. So if any of you guys are interested, I will have my Women's Best link down in the description box. And yeah, that was it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Make sure to smash that thumbs up button if you did. Subscribe if you aren't already and follow me on over at my Instagram. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!